Welcome back to Brianna's Life. I hope you're living your best life. If you're not, I don't know what you doing. And today is Friday, September 20th, 2019. I am blessed to see another day. So today we're going to jump right into the video with the verse of the day. Beloved, follow not that which is evil, but that which is good. He that doeth good is of God, but he that doeth evil hath not seen God. Third John chapter 1 verse 11. I ask God to remind you that he is in control. Every detail of your life is in his hands, so why not simply let go? Don't worry about anything, but in everything, through prayer and petition with thanksgiving, let your request be made known to God. God's strength makes us strong. His comfort comforts us. With him, we no longer run. We rest. Moses said to God, Suppose I go to the Israelites and say to them, The God of your fathers has sent me to you. And they ask me, What is his name? Then what shall I tell him? God said to Moses, I am who I am. This is what you are to say to the Israelites. I am has sent me to you. Exodus chapter 3, verse 13 through 14. Understand, Moses questions God. Does it appear that God was patient with Moses' questions or that Moses' insecurities angered God? Is it okay to bring your questions to God? What do you think God meant when he referred to himself as I am? God was not worried or taken aback by the question. He told Moses to tell the Israelites he had been sent by I am. God's essence is not containable in human language. No word or phrase can describe him. I am signifies that God indeed exists. He is different from all other life. He was, is, and will be. Whatever the Israelites needed on their exodus from Egypt, God was. He parted the Red Sea at just a necessary moment and yet allowed it to swallow up their pursuers. He led them by fire and by cloud. He provided water for their parchedness. He showered them with daily bread. If there is one thing we know about our Lord, it is that he is unchanging. He is the same yesterday, today, and forever. He is the same yesterday, today, and forever. The great I Am stands ready to meet your needs today just as he did for the Israelites. Great I am, I humbly ask you to take the reins and lead me day to day, step by step through life, just as you led your people out of slavery in the land of Egypt. Amen. And the five quotes are, every couple needs to argue now and then, just to prove that the relationship is strong enough to survive. You come to love not by finding the perfect person, but by learning to see an imperfect person perfectly. The more you talk about negative things in your life, the more you call them in. Speak victory, not defeat. Look for something positive in each day, even if some days you have to look a little harder. Believe in yourself. Have faith in your abilities. Without a humble but reasonable confidence in your own powers, you cannot be successful or happy. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on post notifications so you're notified every time I post a new video. Make sure you live your best life and have a blessed day.